So this year in 2020, one of the key concepts in MDS and AML has become targeting the TP53 uh, axis uh, in cancer cells. So for some review, TP53 is extremely important. This is aberrant or mutated in up to 50, 50% of all human cancers, making it the most or one of the most common uh, mutations in all of cancer. That's both solid and liquid tumors. In addition to being ubiquitous, TP53 has historically been extremely difficult, if not impossible, to directly uh, target. Uh, other drugs and molecules have tried to indirectly target that axis, um, and so that's the background. Furthermore, in most patients who are TP53 mutated uh, across hematologic blood cancer malignancies, it almost invariably is a poor prognostic state uh, despite uh, different tumor types, chronic, so CLL versus, uh, say, AML acute leukemia. So this is a, a well-sought-after target, urgent, unmet medical need, poor prognostic feature. That's the background. Now, into 2020, there are several drug molecule programs, either as a single agent or in combination, that are attempting to really be the first real efforts in targeting uh, this TP53. And one of those is the uh, APR246 molecule. So this agent, either a single agent or now in combination with hypomethylator, azacitidine, is showing some early but some uh, promising data, clinical data, in patients with this so-called high-risk group, uh, these TP53 mutated patients, MDS, uh, and then potentially AML. 